Welcome to Slab Bazaar's PowerPoint for Pros, a video series that will help you become better at PowerPoint. In this video, let's learn how to design a one-pager business plan slide. But before that, check out Slab Bazaar's free PowerPoint add-in to get presentation templates, themes, and other design tools, along with an AI-powered presentation creator. Check the add-in for free using the link in the description. Anyway, let's move on to the video. Let's take a look at how you can design a one-pager business slide in PowerPoint. This is the slide that we're going to design today. Let's begin by adding a rectangular shape as shown. You can go to Insert and then Shapes to do this. Draw a shape over the slide like this and then press Ctrl and drag it to duplicate it. Create two duplicates and place them side by side. Now select them all and group them by pressing Ctrl plus G. Once grouped, drag the handle on the right side to widen the shape till it covers the whole slide. Next, right click the slide, go to Grid and Guides and add vertical and horizontal guides on your slide. These guides will help you design better. Move the vertical guides to align them with the sides of your slide and then hold Ctrl and click and drag the vertical line to duplicate them and place these duplicates on the lines created by the shapes and the other side of the slide as well. Create more duplicates and place the guides on the left and right sides of the two guides in the middle. Pay attention to the number visible near your mouse to place them equidistant from each other. Do the same for the guides on each side of the slide as well. Similarly, duplicate the horizontal guides as well and place them above and below to create margins for your design. Once done, let's right click the slide, click on format object and change the color of the shapes and apply no line. Now it's a matter of adding text boxes with these margins in mind. Go to insert and add text boxes to each section. For now, I'm just going to copy paste some text boxes I made earlier. I start with the company name and add each text box for problem statement, solution, product overview and more. Go to the design tab and play around with the colors and fonts to get what you want. You can also insert charts. Just make sure you resize them to fit between the margins you've created. Now, if you're going to insert images onto your one-pager slide, here's a quick and easy way to do it. Insert a shape on your slide and then resize it. Then copy it, go to the slide master, clear the slide and paste the shape you just created. Now go to insert placeholder and draw an image placeholder over the shape. Select both of them, go to Merge Shapes in the Shape Format tab and click on Intersect. Create duplicates of this new placeholder if needed. And now, all you need to do is go back to the normal view by clicking Close Master View and go back to your slide. Right-click, click Layout and choose the master slide you've just created. And now all you need to do is click on the image placeholders and insert your image. I am also going to add a map by going to insert, chart, map and clicking on OK. Resize it to fit between the margins as well. You can also choose to copy an SVG map or simply go to the slide bazaar add-in tab and choose a map from the library. You can get the add-in for free using the link in the description. Add some more images and fine tweak the slide and here's what your finished one-pager business plan will look like. Also, if you don't have time to do all of this and want an easier alternative, check out Slide Bazaar's PowerPoint templates. The link will be in the description. That's all for now. If you found this video helpful, please like the video and subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to check out Slide Bazaar's free PowerPoint add-in. The link will be in the description.